For the 100% cheapest coins on the internet with reliable delivery and quick customer support, check out my sponsor MMOEXP by clicking the link at the top of the description and use code SWIFT at checkout for 5% off. Soul Salsa family, and so today I'm coming back at you guys with another Madden 21 video on the channel and in today's video, let's make free coins. Now there is a very easy way to make about 150 to 200,000 coins in the new draft promo. Let me show you guys exactly how to do that and exactly how every single person watching this can claim some free coins. Now, as we get into this video, if you have not yet left a like down below, leave a like down below. It helps out the channel so very much. And of course, if you're watching this and you're not yet subbed to the channel, I do post videos similar to this showing you how to make free coins, coin making methods, and strategies to help you build your ultimate team. So if you like the sound of that and you're not yet subbed to the channel, scroll down and hit that sub button. But without further ado, let's get into the video. Now, the way we're going to be making these coins in today's video is focusing on the 99 overall master sets combined with some of the solo challenges in the game right now to get these players or these pieces in the cheapest way possible and then complete the 99 overall master and make your coins just like that. Now taking a deeper dive into the sets right here, you will see that you do need 297s and 195 to complete the 99 and in today's video we're going to get a 97 for free and get a 95 at the cheapest price possible which is then going to allow us to complete the set for under 250k and we can sell off Antonio for over 400,000 coins. So as I mentioned before, let's get into step number one which is going to give us a 97 overall player for free, which we can then use in the sets. What we're going to do is go to our solo challenges, scroll on down to our draft solos, and as you will see, if you complete all 40 of these solos, you are going to earn yourself a nat 97 overall draft fantasy pack, which we can then select a player from and put into the AB set. Now, there's kind of two strategies when it comes to playing these solos. If you are just looking to get all the solos done and you want that 97 overall pack, you can play these on one star difficulty. That is going to mean you are playing these on arcade mode. It is going to be super easy. It is going to be the easiest way possible. You don't have to worry about the bonus star because all you need to do is play all the challenges. It's similar to some of the other solo sequences in the game. You would just need to play them on one star. But if you are looking to rack up stars to then get this 99 overall player for free, I would recommend you guys play these on full star difficulty. Now, my recommendation is probably to play these on full star anyways, as it's kind of two birds with one stone. You're going to get closer to the free 99 and you're still going to earn that 97 for free. It isn't really that much more challenging to play these on full star difficulty. A lot of the solos are simply like stop your opponent on one drive or score a passing touchdown on this play, which isn't going to be that hard. Your team is typically a lot better than these squads. So get these solos done and get the 97 overall fantasy pack. Let's quickly open it up in today's video because I want to show you guys how fire the draft animation is. As you will see, we have a nat 97 overall draft fantasy pack. We can select any of these players. It doesn't really matter which one we take because all of them are going to go into the sets. But look at that animation, boys. EA has done an absolutely beautiful job on the animations this year. Some pretty solid cards in here. None of them are really worth starting on your team, I don't think. So that's why we're going to use these cards in the coin making method. Let's take Harold Carmichael right here. It doesn't matter which one we go with. And at this point, we have a 97 for free. Now we're not going to put it into one of the sets yet because we don't know exactly what set we want to do. But let's get into the second part of the method. Now the second part of this method is going to be something that you guys will have obtained as you played through these solos. As you can see in the NFL draft solos, as we go to the milestones at tier number four, you're getting an 89 plus overall NFL draft draft pass player and what we're going to do is we're going to open the pack up and then essentially we're going to upgrade that player all the way up to a 95 which is cheaper than just buying the 95 overall on the block now this pack is something that everyone should have even if you played the solos on one star difficulty so let's open it up right here hopefully crossing our fingers we get like a 95 that would be awesome i'm expecting like an 89 though a 91 or a 93 helps us even more and it looks like we are going to be getting a 91 dan arnold i would assume a lot of you guys are probably going to get like 91s it is pretty easy to get a card like that. So now what we're going to do is go into the sets and we're going to upgrade this player all the way to a 95. Now, basically right now, every single one of these sets is selling at a two to one ratio. And what I mean by that are 95s are selling at double the price of a 93. 93s are selling at double the price of a 91. So pulling any of these cards is going to allow you to save your coins and you're not going to be losing out on coins because the ratio is the same on all the sets. So we're going to put our 91 into here. We're going to try and snipe another 91 at the cheapest price possible. 19 k for the Adrian Phillips we will definitely take that. If you want a refresh on the filter, you can maybe try and find this card up for like 16 or 15k, but I'm not going to be that crazy about it. We'll take the 91 right here and we will get a 93. Now with this 93, we are going to put it into the 95 set and so on and so forth until we upgrade our card to a 95. Now, if you started with an 89, again, you'd be starting off a little bit lower, but we'll take any of these 93s. We'll put the 93 into the set and then we are going to continue upgrading. So move your way up to the 95 set, put in the 93 that you had before at this point, you've 
we've only spent 20k on this 93 when these 93s right now are actually selling for a price of around 40k so you're kind of getting a good deal on the 93 which then leads to us getting a good deal on the 95 which then leads to us getting a good deal on the set so 40k for the card i'm not going to complain about it at this point we have spent 60k on the sets right here and that is going to enable us to get the 95 now if we wanted to snipe on this filter we definitely could and we probably could find the 93s for cheaper but right now 95s are selling for around 80k so if you guys kind of remember the dan arnold was selling for 20 so we essentially shaved off 20k off of the cost of the card and by going up on a two to one ratio you can ensure that basically whatever card you pull is going to shave off the exact amount that they're going for from the price of the 95 okay so at this point all we have spent is 60k and we have a 95 as well as a 97 all that is required is one more 97 overall player now in order to get our 97 for the cheapest price possible we are going to complete the set for the 97 overalls as you will see these 97 overalls are going to require two 95s to knock it out and these 95s are only selling for around 75k we can honestly snipe them at under that price potentially 70k for the card and if we do that we're only spending 140k on the 97 rather than spending that 160 to 170 thousand coins so go by the auction block filter it down by 94 to 95 and the program nfl draft and we are going to refresh on there and hopefully find these 95s for a price of around 70k if we find them in that price that is going to be a very very nice price point that is going to be much cheaper than sniping the 97s and there's honestly just a whole bunch more activity on this filter as you will see basically every single time we refresh there's going to be new cards getting posted up new cards selling new cards getting posted up so i'm going to refresh on here for a couple of minutes hopefully we find a card up for around 70k even if we buy it around 74 like this troy hill is that's still a pretty solid deal because we're actually going to be getting the card for cheap taste hill at 64 that would be awesome if we land it and we're just half a second too slow but there is a ton of activity on this filter like i did mention 72k for taste hill will definitely take that as well that is going to be a solid deal so definitely filter it down by this program and get the 95s instead of just buying a 97 as it is far cheaper to do it this way so there we go i would assume we probably just spent around 200,000 coins to get all these players we need to upgrade into 197 it doesn't matter which one you do we'll put both the 95s into here these are the 95s that we did just get for cheap we have an aj boye we have the other 97 we got for free and we have the 95 overall player that we got for cheap but wait there is one final step to the method we need to go into the auction block and see which one of these cards is more expensive so filter down by 98 to 99 on the program nfl draft and whichever one of these cards is more expensive we are going to do the set for so as you guys can see cam chancellor is a little bit more expensive than the ab we are going to complete the cam chancellor set we will get cam we will get his power up and we can sell off the card for around 415k after we did just get him for around 200,000 coins so definitely a must you guys all need to be doing this we're going to put in the cards that we did just obtain into the set the 97 that we got for cheap the harold carmichael that we got the free for free and the 95 that we got for cheap and we now have cam chancellor the 99 overall version of the card if we wanted to keep him we definitely could we'd be getting him at a really good deal we are going to sell him off right here and we are going to make those easy coins hope you guys have enjoyed today's video if you did scroll down and leave a like hit that sub button if you are new and until next time boys i'm out peace so, 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 so.